Hey gang, thanks for joining me in yet another video. It's a beautiful fall day again here in Western North Carolina, and I'm kind of in a bean mood. So I'm going to make for you the dish that my wife loves the most. This is a 15 bean stew with bacon and sausage. I hope you like it. Before we go any further, I'd like to remind you guys, please don't forget to mash that subscribe button, give me a big old thumbs up, maybe even leave me a comment or two, I sure would appreciate it. For today's recipe, I'll be using a 14 inch Dutch oven, two packages of 15 bean soup mix, a full pound of bacon and a full pound of sausage, two quarts of chicken broth, and two cans of Rotel. Because we're using so much sausage and bacon, no real additional spices will be needed. So let's start by cutting the bacon into one inch chunks, like this. Okay, you guys know how to cut bacon. I have preheated my Dutch oven, and I'm gonna put the bacon in and cook it thoroughly. After the bacon's good and cooked, go ahead and put in your sausage and brown it all the way through. The only seasoning I added was garlic. I put in two heaping tablespoons. And one minced onion. At this point, this is what your mix should look like. And go ahead and add your two cans of Rotel. Stir it around real well until it gets heated through. You can be doing this outdoors. I just chose to do this portion inside. Now, add your beans. These were soaking since last night. Mix it thoroughly and then add your two quarts of chicken broth. The key to this is to get the chicken broth just above the line of the beans. Add a little water if necessary. Again, stir it around very thoroughly. Say that reminds me, if y'all are looking for a way to support this channel, keep this here train a rolling full of farm fresh content twice a week, why don't you slide over to my Teespring shop, get yourself a coffee mug or maybe even a t-shirt. But if you don't want to do that, how about you go to buymeacoffee.com and for the price of a cup of coffee, you help keep this train a-rolling. You can also visit boondockerswelcome.com. All of the links are in the description. Thanks a bunch. Now, using all bottom heat, that's about 25 coals on the bottom, put your Dutch oven on top of it. The idea is to get it to a rapid boil at first. Let's see how it's progressing. At this point, it's still a little on the soupy side. I've reduced the heat by moving some coals from the side, but if you notice, I'm leaving the lid off just a little tiny bit to let some of that vapor get through. Now look at it. Oh yeah. This is about three hours later. It's nice and stew-like. Look at that. I think it's about ready. So there you have it. My 15 bean stew. I hope you've enjoyed it. I made a double batch this time. Feel free to cut that recipe in half. But I have a whole bunch of family in town. I've got a bunch of people to feed. So I made a double batch. And whatever's left over, it's going in the freezer. Know why? Because it's just as good the second time around, if not better. So go enjoy that recipe. And as always, get to cooking, y'all. See you next time. Bye.